going to spill out. Open her up for me. See, this isn't staged at all, by the way. watching and good morning to you Sam so we're now <laughs> good morning now wrapped up part two of the G81 build and you've come in on a lovely summer's morning here in the UK I don't wear shorts but this man does he's obviously a little bit more fragile than me for temperature but that aside we're about to be involving ourselves in part three so part two DRL's all done part three how it is behind this door and I tell there. you what between me Tim and Sam between me and Sam between me Tim and Al we've got all the parts ready all inside so you're going to be presented yeah, by this they're going to spill out open her up for me see this isn't staged at all by the way no but no. you're about to see what we're about to do for part three it's how you left it last no, it's night it's ready to go it is yeah. yeah it's ready to go it's how you left it last night but come over to thank you very much so obviously Alex has been working hard prepping these bits for you and here they are. Oh yeah, it's been busy. In all of their I seen glory. Them in the last week. <laughs> <laughs> been tucked and screwed away. So, exterior pack part three. Full pack. Full pack. So everything here, I'm not going to bore the viewers at home on this, but you can see front grills, front spoiler, vents, mirrors, side skirts, diffuser. It's all, all here, all ready to go. And uh, Tim, if you just come here, you're not going to leave until all the parts are on. This guy is guarding uh, you. Quality check-in. Quality control security. and the guard is making yeah. sure that you do not leave until that is fitted. So without cool. any further hold up, I'm going to leave you I'll to get it. get sleeping bag out then. Get, get yeah. your head stuck in and enjoy the next two days. Yeah. Woohoo! See you in a bit. Okay, so Dan's gone upstairs, guard dog's gone on tea, on tea break, loo break, real work can get going downstairs. As you can see, we've got the full kit ready for the car to go on. I can walk you quickly through the parts. You've got the DTM front grills, the front ducts, the side vents which go on the wings, door mirror covers, pretty self-explanatory, side skirts, DTM style front splitter, uh, the rear skirts, the rear diffuser, which is uh, as per M performance part, and then the carbon grill surround, which again is also a carbon works first today. Um, so yeah, some nice bits going on this car. I'm gonna be getting busy, as you can tell, uh, and hopefully within the next day or two, we'll have this all fitted on the car, and the external transformation at very least will be complete. Stay tuned.
So guys, we're at the halfway point now. Well, a little over the halfway point actually for the carbon pack on our G81. Uh, it's really starting to take shape as I'm sure you can see. So we've been working hard on the front end as well as down the side. So as you might be able to tell, it's had a replacement grill. Uh, these bumper ducts, which are probably my most favorite piece we do for these cars, our DTM front splitter, which we've done a bit of development on at the same time, which is nice. Um, the yellow DRLs, which we're really happy with. Moving down the side of the car, we've now got the carbon vents, uh, the carbon side skirts, and our M Performance, or direct replacement, should I say, carbon fiber door mirror covers. Just the back end to go. We've got a few parts waiting in the wings to go on, which will see soon enough. But first things first, I need to get it out and swap it around so that I can get on the back end and we'll show you guys what that's like. So quick recap, uh, now the car's swapped round of what we've got for the remainder of this segment on the G81. It's all back end, it's all carbon. We've got the diffuser, which is standard, well, M performance style. So that's gonna go on. We've got a carbon surround, which replaces the gloss black trim around the outside of the diffuser. And then lastly, you've got the rear skirts, rear aprons, call them what you will. M performance style again with the winglets. So they're gonna replace the standard gloss black item on the car. Uh, shouldn't be too bad to get this lot done. So we're gonna do a couple of how-to videos on the way. Keep an eye out for those. We'll see you on the other side. Right, part three is now complete and she's finished exterior wise for now anyway. I'm blown away. This thing looks so wide. Just check out the back of that. It just looks insanely good. We've obviously got quite a lot of carbon going on here now on the back end. Diffuser, diffuser surround, side spats. If you follow me down the side of the car, we've also got the side skirts, which we've gone for an OEM style side skirt rather than having the kick up. A little bit different. Personally, I really like it. Door mirrors side breathers, front splitter, front air intake vents, and of course the big grill at the front. It looks absolutely insane. You've done an all right job there, Sam. 
Well, I hope you like it. I do. I mean, it's not coming back off again. No, I hope not. No, I like it. I think that's trick. What do you think so far? Do you like it yourself? Yeah, some people are going to get out of the way when this is coming down the road, aren't it's they? It's 41, isn't it? Yeah. It needs to look aggressive. Amazing. I'm chuffed to bits with the look of this car now. It looks insane. So we'll wrap up here now. Let's get straight into part four. We'll see you guys on the other side. Like, share, subscribe. Oh, 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 oh,